cereal mongers. Welcome to Wednesday. Today we're going to do a Marbits edition. The kitties are at grandma's because we just got back from Thanksgiving and we got in at like 2 a.m. So we decided to leave the kitties at grandma's until tonight. So that means today's special guests are a jackhammer outside and the refrigerator that just turned on. Say la vie. So the reason that we got back at 2 a.m. is because we were traveling from Tennessee all the way back to Queens. And on the way back, we stopped at Love's in Pennsylvania. It's a truck stop, and they have a convenience store that has things like, you know, antifreeze, wiper blades, showers, and snacks. So today is Lucky Charms. Marshmallow Cereal Bar by General Mills. Expect to see more of these because they had more than just this one. But this week, it's this one. So, I'm gonna open it up and see how it is. But this is what it's promising. And I am so excited. Ooh. Okay. Be careful about lifting it because the product information is on the packaging. Love the packaging. This retailed for, I believe, a dollar nineteen per bar. So you can see it's just like a big marshmallow rice crispy treat, except it's a lucky charm treat. Look, there's a rainbow. No double rainbow. Nope. Double rainbow. <laughs> okay. So here's the back. It's like this creamy stuff on the back. It's sticky on the front to keep the charms together. Or the, the cereal anyway. So I just broke it apart so I could eat it better. Okay. That's kind of delicious. My instant uh, criticism, don't need this part. That creamy crap on the bottom that's supposed to be milk don't need it too sweet but the top part um no that is delicious it tastes like lucky charms but in a rice krispie treat form it's awesome full deduction for this part like but let's talk about it shall we give you the nutrition information. Nutrition facts, one bar is 200 calories, total fat six grams. Woo, no cholesterol still, that's good. It means there's no animal product in it that's contributing cholesterol, which I find interesting. I would expect there to be gelatin or, you know, something, but whatever. Okay, sodium 170 milligrams, total carbs is 36 grams. Dietary fiber is less than a gram, sugars is 19. It doesn't even say anything about other carbs it just keeps on going proteins only two grams let's see anything good about vitamins and minerals there's a lot of 10 percent a 15 percent for folic acid it's really not that good for you in the uh, vitamins and minerals category so we'll just uh stick it up on the website and you can see it that way the ingredients themselves whole grain oats that's the number one for the cereal and oat flour is in there too. Sugar is number two on the list and corn syrup is number three. Oh, sorry, number four. But, you know, at least it has some whole grain oats in it. And then, because it is, you know, it's Lucky Charms. That's what Lucky Charms are. It talks about the marshmallow, which does have gelatin and doesn't say that it's vegetarian gelatin. So we'll... <laughs> Say this is not vegetarian friendly if you're that specific about your vegetarianism which a lot of people are just you know this is gelatin in it and then it has a whole bunch of crisp rice canola oil fructose high fructose corn syrup corn syrup sugar so this is very sugary if you couldn't tell from just looking at the thing and the allergens listed milk and soy ingredients are included I will make th make sure by going very carefully through the list that they didn't omit any of the allergens because now that I found that one allergen that wasn't listed below in one of the other sales, I'm a little nervous. So I'll let you know. So this is the Lucky Charms treat. I'm going to give it another bite. Even if I eat it upside down. 
Mm. Eat it upside down if you're gonna eat this part. Makes it better. Mm. Oh yeah, upside down is the way to go. Definitely. Because it's not that awesomely nutriented good for you, but it tastes really awesome. And it's a cool way to have a portable cereal for the morning. I'm gonna go four bowls because I love it. So that's been Cereal Wednesday Marbets edition this week. And I'll see you next week. Have a good one. Yeah. <laughs>